千里之行，始于足下。A journey of a thousand miles begins beneath the feet. We now gather in the Tao to travel the journey together. Welcome to Tao Talks with Derek Lin, where we take a deep dive into the Tao Te Ching by Lao Tzu. As always, I would like to extend a warm welcome to one and all. Thank you for joining us. I would like to invite you to center your thoughts and direct your attention to this moment in time, to the here and now, to be fully present and mindfully aware, as we all ready ourselves for this sacred process in the Tao with one another. Another insight from the sages is about virtue. Virtue is the key. De is the ultimate standard of existence. It spans heaven and humanity. Cultivators who understand this will not hesitate to practice virtues as much as possible. As soon as possible, as much as possible. They realize that by doing so, we have the ability to shape our own fate. Fate is not something that should be passively accepted. There's actually a lot that we can do about it. This was the one insight from a particular master who was also adept with Yi Jing fortune telling. So he would convey to everyone that his predictions, fortune-telling predictions based on the Yi Jing, would be very accurate, but not accurate at all for people who genuinely practice the Tao. This was because people who did not know the Tao had no choice but to go with fate, and most what he could do for them. Was to give them some pointers on some negativity to avoid, or some ways of remediation or mitigation. He said that the ultimate way, though, is not to follow the advice of a fortune teller, but to create and shape your own destiny. The Tao is the way to let you do that. So there's no passive acceptance. Of fate or destiny in the Tao, there's active shaping of the same thing. That is the reason why we have to examine our own actions, review what we have done. We have to think about, reflect on whether or not my actions will further virtue, accumulate merit. Depending on whether you are leaning more toward the Tao or Buddhist teachings, with the Tao, virtues; with Buddhist teachings, merits. Ultimately, same thing. This means we can utilize the key. We can unlock the master control panel for destiny through conscience, and by that, I mean. Conscientious choices that we make in the actions that we take. This makes a world of sense to me, from the sage, and I hope it makes sense to you. Our meeting has come to an end, but the journey continues on. Let us all travel safely. So we can meet again. Until next time, may the Tao fill you with peace and happiness.